Hey, this is Sam Furman again, coming to you live from my kitchen where I live down here in beautiful Lakeway, Texas. Anyways, I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about and ask yourself this question. If you had $30,000 or more to spend on a vehicle, which one would you buy and why? And let me tell you, I just test drove one of these BMW 535i's yesterday. Sexy as hell, okay? So let me talk about, this is my first time test driving a luxury vehicle in this caliber of class. And some interesting things about the BMW that I want to talk about and that make them the top reason why when I have the funds ready that I will be purchasing either a 535i, a 550, or an M5. I haven't quite made up my mind yet. But the fit and finish of BMW cars are by far just top, top notch high quality. Everything about the 535 that I test drove yesterday just felt good. Now, the 535 has an inline six engine. The 550, BMW 550, has the V8. Now, you say, okay, a piece, an, I, an inline six in a car that big, is it actually fast? Well, I was surprised because it has twin turbo technology. So it has a two scroll turbo that spools up very fast. We were at zero to 60 within uh, right about five seconds. And compared to the F-150 truck that I drive, which is awesome off-road, it's a great towing vehicle, a little different experience. Uh, I couldn't believe how fast we were approaching 80 miles an hour. Like, it is a very easy way to you know, lose your license is having that car, but it's a dream car of mine. It's sexy, I love it. I love the way the seats feel, the way the leather smells. It just grips you right when you're sitting in it. And the handling of that car is so tight. When you make t corners and turns, a lot of cars tend to roll on those corners. The BMW just it squats down and goes through those corners and it's just crisp and smooth. The steering, the dynamic steering of the BMWs are also another great feature that I just have fallen in love with, meaning that the steering ratio changes on your speed. So low speed, you uh, have less turn to turn you know, to, to get the car to move. At high speed, it, it throttles that back so you, you have more control at high speeds. Now, you know, how much does the BMW cost in that series? The base price for a BMW 535 is going to be around 60, I believe this is $65,000. For the, we did the numbers yesterday for a lease, it's going to be right around $1,000 a month. Which sounds high, but when you consider what you're getting for the price, it's actually not that bad a deal. And having a, res, having a recurring residual income, you're able to afford things like that, which is something I am building by having my own home-based business. So. This is definitely going to the dream board. I would recommend the 535i BMW, or if you're feeling like losing your license immediately, the BMW 550 with the V8 engines, it's gonna be a little bit faster, but um, equal complement of luxury and features inside, same, pretty much same body style, same, same car, except a bigger engine. Uh, you know, as far as reliability goes, there are four years, at least four years of coverage you get, uh, bumper to bumper. And then, you know, as far as perception goes, nothing beats a black BMW. It just looks sexy as hell, and that's my number one choice.